The Cheetah Starling SV provides continuous, accurate, non-invasive hemodynamic monitoring and empowers fluid management across the continuum of care. How does it work? Four non-invasive sensor pads are applied to the thorax, creating a box around the heart. A small electrical current is applied across the thorax between the outer pair of sensors, and a voltage signal is recorded between the inner pair of sensors. The flow of blood in the thorax introduces a time delay or phase shift in the signal. Extensive research has shown that these phase shifts are tightly correlated with stroke volume. By continuously measuring these phase shifts, accurate stroke volume is determined. To determine fluid responsiveness or volume status, a dynamic assessment is performed, which challenges the heart with a small amount of fluid to gauge its response. Two ways of performing this fluid challenge are a fluid bolus or a passive leg raise, which translocates 250 to 300 cc's of blood from lower extremities into the heart, providing a reversible challenge of the heart's response to increased fluid load. If the heart can receive more fluid, we will see greater outflow and a longer time delay, equivalent to the increase in stroke volume. If the stroke volume increase is greater than 10%, then the patient is determined to be fluid responsive. The Starling SV monitor also shows the patient's unique position on the Frank Starling curve. If the patient is on the ascending portion of the Starling curve, the patient is considered to be fluid responsive. If on the flat part of the curve, the patient is not fluid responsive. The Cheetah Starling SV helps you determine whether fluid will be effective. If you don't know, check. To learn more about the science behind the Starling SV, please visit cheetah-medical.com.